Welcome to Shift by Bacardi. Hey guys, I'm James Grant from Pablo Cocktail Lounge in Edmonton, and welcome to My Bacardi Shift. So today, for My Bacardi Shift, I'm going to be talking about that uh, that kind of exchange that always happens between bartenders that kind of that tell me about it. You know, uh, bartenders have uh, sort of this role in some cases where a guest. They just want to chat. Maybe they got a problem, maybe they had a long day, maybe they're celebrating something, but they want to talk to somebody. And the bartender's there and it's the bartender's job to do a bit of a sounding board. Maybe they just want someone to listen, maybe they want a bit of advice, but that's what the bartender's there for. So I wanted to do a cocktail that kind of celebrates that back and forth, that collaboration that happens in moments like that. And one of my favorite cocktails to make when we're talking about people collaborating and coming together is a punch. Why? I mean, punches traditionally are drinks that are meant to be enjoyed communally. They're meant to bring people together. Now you can make single serving punches and that's what we're gonna do today. But one of the nice things about it is you can scale the recipe up. It's very, very easy. You can make it for one person, you can make it for 10. So we're going to start with our teeling small batch. We'll do an ounce, two quarters of that. Add a little bit of richness and complexity. We're going to use Benedictine. So Benedictine is a beautiful French liqueur with honey, spices, herbs. It is absolutely one of my favorite ingredients to put in any cocktail. It's delicious. I love it. We're going to put it in this cocktail because why not? We're going to use half an ounce of that. Next up, we have a black tea syrup. This is just a very simple syrup. 500 grams of white sugar, 500 grams of oil boiling water and two black tea bags. Let that rest, eventually take out the tea bag before it gets too, too bitter, and you'll have this really beautiful syrup. Now, we've got our spirit, we've got our modifier, we've got our sweetener. What we don't have is any acid, so we're gonna do some freshly juiced lemon juice. I generally will juice right into my jigger. So we've got three quarters of an ounce there or half a lemon, three quarters of an ounce of fresh lemon juice, and that's gonna give us the acid that we need. Finally, I'm gonna do two dashes of just your classic Angostura bitters. Now we've got everything in there, all that's left is to shake it. So we're gonna use a couple of big chunks of ice here to shake this cocktail up. Funny, when you talk about telling me about it or things that uh, guests often ask about, that's one thing right there. How do you get a tin open? I always get these tins stuck together. So I'm gonna take this opportunity to quickly show you. You can sort of see where the two tins start to come apart right there. When these tins are kind of sealed together, that's the weakest part of that seal. So what you wanna do is just give it a nice quick crack right where they start to separate. We've got it in our mixing tin, shaken up, it's ready to go. Now we just need to strain this into our glass. Now I've got my glass ready to go here, but I want this to be a little more refreshing than your typical kind of punch. Like, punch can be a little bit of rich, we've got a little, a, quite a few rich ingredients in there. So, we're gonna add one ounce, maybe more depending on what kind of a fill level we get there, but one ounce is a good place to start. Soda water in, and we'll just Drain that over our ice. And to finish off what we're calling our Phoenix Punch here, one of my favorite things about punches is that they're not necessarily always garnished with citrus peels or cherries or olives or anything like that. They're garnished often with spices. So they're perfect for kind of colder weather, fall, winter, but honestly, you can enjoy a punch anytime. So I'm gonna do some fresh cinnamon on top. Just microplane it over the top. You can use cinnamon, nutmeg, what I have is cinnamon. We're gonna take a little sip of that, and that is our Phoenix Punch. Thanks for coming to my Bacardi Shift, guys. Cheers. And uh, next time you're sitting at the bar and you got something on your mind, tell me about it.